Ludomoth Creations and I am back! I have a couple boxes! I thought you said you didn't have any boxes, lady. You canceled all your boxes. I did. <laughs> but I got my Witch's Roots and then I'll be doing my Witch's Moon. I guess I already paid for those. I was really um, thinking that I wouldn't be getting anything for October and here we go. So. Yay! Hopefully Sawin stuff is coming. So, hello and welcome guys. If you're new to my channel, my name is Lisa and on my channel, I like to do lots of witchy things including unboxings. And um, I'm taking a break though after this month apparently <laughs> to move and guess what guys? I got the house that I was looking at um, for rent. I'm not buying right now. Um, but yay! So I'm going to be moving close to family. I'm so excited but not until December. So anyways, alright let's get into the box. Lucy. All right. Yes. Right in with Sawin. The theme for this box is Ancestor Calling. As Sawin arrives, we begin to prepare for the honoring and calling of ancestors and spirit guides. With clear intention and purpose, we spend our time truly practicing our craft. We are eager to fulfill our need for connection during this time so that we are able to fully embrace the coming of darker months. This very unique and stunning collection provides useful tools to use during your Sawin rituals and meditations. The magical items in this box are as follows. And excuse me, like I don't normally wear like this much makeup and like lipstick and stuff, but I went somewhere, so I was like, I'm gonna look good. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh! Okay, so here's my Oracle card. There's the back and the front. Oh my God, it's Egyptian! Yes, I wonder what deck this is. I mean, I guess they'll probably tell us. It says, honoring the deities around you, prayers, offerings, and help. Oh, you guys know I love me some Egyptian shiz. All right. We have meditated and selected a card from the Ancestor Spirit Oracle Cards by Jade Sky, illustrated by Belinda Morris. I have to look this deck up to place inside your box. This card and the symbols, messages that are represented were meant for you. Take the time to reflect on the wisdom that it holds. Know that there is a specific reason you have received this card. Let it resonate with you and speak to the pressing realities in your world. Allow this message to act as a direct message from your guides. So honor the deities around you. Prayers, offerings, help. Yes. Okay, that means something to me. But how pretty is that? All right, and now our artwork. So we have the ancestral connection. Because you lived, I live. Oh, that's pretty. I love their artwork so much. Um, this probably won't say much on here. This beautiful ancestral connection artwork was created to represent our connection to the ancestors that lived before us. You will see written near the bottom of the piece, because you lived, I live. Place this within your book of shadows or display on your Samhain altar, written and illustrated by A.E. Eldon. All right, and apparently our herb for this month is going to be Yerba Santa, because that's what this is. All right, Yerba Santa Herbal Grimoire artwork. We have partnered with a blah, 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 with a very talented local artist to create an exclusive piece of artwork to honor Yerba Santa. Add this beautiful artwork to your Book of Shadows, Herbal Grimoire, or place on your altar for display, written and illustrated by A.E. Eldon. All right. Get some crinkle papers over here. Ooh, I think I smell cinnamon. Oh, how cute is, oh, how cute is this? <gasps> Okay, look at this little scroll. Are you fucking kidding? Sorry. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, something is on this that means a bunch to me, but I can't share it right now. <laughs> um, it's, it's a very private thing right this second, um, but OMG. Okay, so here's a little, it's a scroll. It's got a feather. And then there's some like gold thingamajiggers <laughs> and there's a little key. There's a little key. Oh my gosh, this means a lot to me. Wow. Okay. All right. Let's see what this is all about. Ancestral Petition Scroll. The scroll has been put together by hand by A.E. Alden for this specific collection. This scroll is intended for you to write down a message 
for your ancestral guides. Be sure to write specific intentions, requests, or gratitudes. Place upon your altar during time of spiritual connection. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. Yay. All right. Now we have a sachet with a necklace. Oh. All right. So there's the front. Hopefully you guys can see that. It almost looks like a skull with like a little bit of moon. It looks like the skull has like a mohawk. You guys, I don't know if you can see it or not. On the back it says, Beloved ancestors, hear my call. Guide my heart and hands as you see and know all. So there's the back. Very nice. Here, we'll put it on. I'll put this on. Well, I should have worn like a, another Halloween shirt. Darn it. I have like a few. Um, the Halloween shirt that I wore the other day, it's... Um, it's from LuLaRoe. I always wear their leggings because like they're super comfortable. I have a pair on right now. Um, but the shirt, the style of it, God bless America, is called um, the Randy, which is actually my ex-boyfriend's name. <laughs> Whatever. But uh, I love the style of shirt. It's like a like a three-quarter length sleeve like baseball shirt. I'm having a hard time baseball shirt and I've got like three or four Halloween um, shirts from them in that style. Yay! I finally got it. Okay. There we go. All right. Next, we've got a candle. I cannot believe that we're like, it's almost mid-October, y'all. So we have a black um, mini beeswax candle. Let's see what it says. Ancestral Honoring Mini Spell Candle. We have hand rolled this Ancestral Honoring Mini Spell Candle with the intention of providing you with a token of gratitude and recognition for the connection you hold with your ancestral guides. Burn this candle on a Samhain or Ancestral Altar. Very nice. I smell cinnamon. I don't know if it's coming from there or if it's um, from something else in here. So now we have another sachet. And um, yes, it is a tumbled black obsidian. Very nice. Black obsidian is a type of volcanic glass known to be a sacred stone to many cultures. Black obsidian is a powerful stone that can help protect against negative energies and intentions of others. In addition to providing protection, black obsidian assists the practitioner in attracting love, money, success, as well as promoting truth, clarity, and understanding, specifically with spirit connection. We have included this specific stone within this collection to aid you in communicating with your ancestral guides, working to find clarity in the signs and symbols you may receive. Elemental Association of Earth. Speaking of crystals, I just actually ran out of uh, black obsidian, but I have tons of crystals, and if you guys did not see in my, um, my video the other day, all of my crystals are on sale 30% off. This is the lowest I'm going to go. <laughs> so get it before somebody else does. I'm hoping to sell as much as I can before I move because like, I really don't want to bubble wrap and try to move all those crystals. So I have some really amazing things. Um, I have price ranges all over the place and again, 30% off. So then we have our Yerba Santa. Yerba Santa leaf also known as mountain balm and beer weed. Smoke it. Um, the Yerba Santa plant can be found growing under uh, canopies of redwoods. Medicinally, Yerba Santa has always been prepared as a tea or tonic to help eliminate congestion and other respiratory ailments. This herb has also been included into tinctures or made into rich syrups. The name Yerba Santa means holy herb in Spanish excuse me, in Spanish. <laughs> My inflection was wrong. <laughs> in Spanish. And it has always been revered as a magically potent ingredient. In addition to the many protective qualities this herb contains, Yerba Santa also bolsters our spiritual strength and psychic powers, allowing us to understand and perceive information from guides more clearly. We've included Yerba Santa into this very special collection for you to incorporate its energies into your ancestral altar. This altar can include pictures of loved ones lost or items that may represent their impact on your life. Take the time to make this altar beautiful 
and symbolically potent elemental association water and earth celestial moon uh venus and earth and gender is feminine very good I'm like having some issues i'm getting lipstick all over the place hopefully it's not on my teeth <laughs> i don't normally wear bright lipstick like this okay and then we have here's my cinnamon that i was smelling we have some cinnamon incense Mm -hmm. I'm just get lipstick on that too. I am getting lipstick everywhere, y'all. Mm -hmm. Okay, cinnamon ritual incense sticks. These wonderful fragrant ritual incense sticks were placed within this collection to enhance the energy that surrounds you during this sacred time. Mm, I love all the smells of um, fall. Oh, we have another herb. So we've got some rose petals. Very nice. This means something to me too. <laughs> So this is an ancestral box for Samhain, and my grandma's name is Rosemary, and she goes by Rose. A lot of people just call her Rose, but of course, roses remind me of her. And she passed um, in 2018. I think it was 2000. It was 18 or 17 or 18. Already, <gasps> mm, I'm tired. Rose petals. We have included an offering of rose petals for you to incorporate into your Samhain or ancestral altar. Perfect. These beautiful dried petals can be placed around the base of your candle or simply placed within a small bowl in the front of images of ancestors or magical trinkets that represent them. Planetary Association Venus, Elemental Water, Gender Feminine. I love it. Perfect. Thank you, the Witch's Moon. Okay, got a little bit more crinkle paper that could be yours. If you guys go to my shop and order something, this could be yours. Yeah. All right, moving along. <laughs> All right, so we have a spray. And did we expect anything less? It's Ancestor Calling. I'm excited. Let's spray this shit. <laughs> Let me put my ad atomizer, atom atomizer, atomizer. Let's put it in there. It's gonna be great. I feel fall smells coming on. Or maybe not. It smells very um, subtle. What is it? Okay, ancestral calling ritual aura spray. We are thrilled to be able to introduce our ancestor calling ritual aura spray within this collection. Blah, 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 blah. This very special blend was created to connect you with your guides and ancestral companions. As you spray around yourself, allowing your energies to become calm, now is the time to speak to your guides and to say aloud your intentions. We have created this ritual aura spray with the oils of cedarwood, sweet orange, rose, clove, and a special, mi special mixture of our spiritus magical oil from our personal cabinet of witchery. Wonderful. I wonder if I shook it enough. Because it's shake it. Try it again. Still very subtle. Like I don't smell like mega smells or anything like that. I don't smell mega smells. <laughs> okay, I think that is it for our witches roots for October 2022. Thank you guys for tuning in. Even though I said I was done, I told you I might have some straggler boxes. I just really didn't expect it to be the witches moon and the witches roots. I didn't even get like a tracking number on this. I don't know if it's because I canceled my account. I mean, I didn't really. I just. I don't know. I just canceled the subscription, but I didn't get tracking. So I had zero idea this was coming. It was a very nice surprise because I bet there's going to be some really great things in the other box as well. So I would love to hear what you guys think. Give me a thumbs up and leave me comments below. It really helps out my channel. And if you guys are not a current subscriber and you want to wait to see what I end up doing with this channel, I would love if you'd hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And guys, you know I love you all so much who have been with me and follow me all the time. So you guys rock. All right, until next time, guys, have a great day. Bye.